Hello Libra and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a great day today. So let's see what's going on around you in love, what spirit wants you to know. Just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. What I'm seeing is uh, this. there's a masculine here. I feel like it's a masculine. You could be dealing with maybe a Sagittarius. You could possibly be a Libra. Maybe Scorpio energy. Oh boy, I'm just feeling like you're giving this person, a, this is it. You're cutting this person off. You're making a final judgment call on this. Okay, and it says here earned reward. So I feel like um, you're getting rewarded for choosing yourself. Okay, you're being rewarded by the divine for having self-respect for having boundaries, standards, morals, and values, okay? Um, taking a stand for yourself and not backing down, basically. So I feel like you're going to start receiving blessings here. Um, it could be, I've, I've been getting a lot of like advancement energy. So spirit is like, moving you up or moving you forward okay you may start notice noticing this in like little ways like um you go through a drive-through and everybody else is waiting in in one side of the drive-through and you get to pet you kind of are able to pass through the other side okay you see what i'm saying you get you're getting like pushed forward in line i feel like no more wait time for you uh, you may be noticing this, you know, if you're driving, you could be like seriously hitting every green light. Okay, you see what I mean? Um, yeah, even if somebody says that you can't have a specific thing or an opportunity, I feel like somehow the divine opens it up for you. And you've been waiting for these blessings for a really long time is what I'm getting. Yeah, you're making a judgment call, though, on this person, and they're about to take this uh, this very passionate action towards you. They realize they're out of time, and they're missing you terribly here. With, the, with this Four of Cups, it just, it makes me feel like they miss you, okay? This person could have put you in third parties in the past, cheated on you. They're being haunted by that. Okay, it says here, haunting loss. Uh, yeah, they're haunted by the choice they made to let you go. This is something that this person can't stop thinking about is the day that they, that they let you go. The day that they made that fateful decision and chose possibly someone else over you. Now they want to communicate, they want to take this action uh, because they've, they realize they've wasted too much time already. So this person, uh, you know, you've heard nothing from this person, okay? No communication, no contact, no action, no nothing, and all of a sudden everything's going to start speeding up. They feel you disconnecting from them, okay? And they're able to see you on some kind of glow up or they realize that you're getting rewarded here um, rewarded for your effort rewarded for your integrity really passing the tests that's that's really what this reward is you've passed every single test so now i feel like um you're getting new opportunities right moving up moving up yeah, see, this person is missing you, longing for you, yearning for you, okay? They miss you like crazy. I miss you like crazy. I miss you like crazy. Yeah, look, <laughs> I know I don't really know that song. I don't know who does it, but I just heard it. Anyway, um... Yeah, wherever they are, they're realizing they wasted too much time here. This is time in their life that they can't get back. And they, they've wasted so much time in doing right by you that they may not get you back either. This person's doing a lot of crying. Try, I feel like they're trying to ex, like have some acceptance here that they may not get you back. But 
the Knight of, of Wands is extremely hopeful. Like the Knight of Wands is kind of fearless, hopeful. Um, they take action. They go after what they want. And so this person, yeah, they're coming towards you. They may need to travel, okay, to get to you. This person may be coming on a motorcycle or they may own a motorcycle, okay? But yeah, this is them missing you, missing you, missing you, missing you. And realizing they, they're realizing they wasted too much time. They've got no time left. You're disconnecting here and moving on with, their, with your life. And they need to come in as quickly as they can. That's what this person is thinking. You could be dealing with a water sign, a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sagittarius. Yeah, because you're leaving them behind like a ponytail in the wind. You know, and I know it says encouraged, but if you cover up the words, it takes on a whole new meaning. You've taken your trading wheels off. You're done moving slow. It's time, like everything is speeding up for you now. Okay, everything is speeding up for you now. And this person is seeing this and they're like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Um, with every day you get further in separation from this person, further and further out of their life. It's, it's, it's in an, on an energetic level. Okay. I think I'm starting to get a cold, you guys. I'm sorry. I, I probably sound a little bit snorkely. <laughs> um, it could be allergies too. I don't know. Yeah, look, blessings coming in for you. Pushing you forward in life very quickly or pushing you up levels very quickly. Because this is just, you, this has had you sitting in stagnancy for too long. And spirit just wants you to start living your life. You know, so they're sending you these opportunities, these open doorways here for you. I'm telling you, it feels like no more waiting for you. It's almost like... You're about to get some kind of like rock star treatment, okay? <laughs> That's really what it feels like here. It really does feel like that. Like people could be opening doors for you. They, um, you could be like able to move forward in lines and um, not have to wait for things. And I'm telling, I'm telling you, you're gonna notice it. I've noticed it in my own life. I'm like, wow. You know, um, whereas before we may have felt some blockages, right? Not anymore, collective, not anymore. Spirit is putting you, this is almost like it, it really does feel like rock star treatment. You're getting rock star treatment from the divine, okay? From the universe. It's, I feel like it's time. It's time that, um, you get bumped up in line. It's time that you get, um, you know, you, it's time that you get these opportunities without, without the weight. I feel like it's just been, you've been stagnant for so long that now it's time for things to move forward for you. Okay. So you're going to start seeing things like that, you know, and this person is over here unfulfilled with whoever they chose over you. I feel like they could have gotten someone pregnant. They could have gotten in some kind of commitment. They're feeling very vulnerable because they know that this, this situation is about to crumble. This is them feeling a tower moment before it hits. They know that it's the end of that situation. They do not want to be there. Yeah, so if this person chose someone else over you, they can't stand it where they are. They're not happy. Their heart is actually with you, see? Their heart is actually with you. This, this person, they hate their life right now. If they're with somebody else, they can't stand it. And they're feeling very discouraged, like... Will they ever get a chance with you again? They miss you so bad. 
You know, I'm really kind of picking up on that. This person doesn't even want to be around this other, whoever they chose over you, this other woman, this other feminine, this third party. Um, they don't even want to be around them. Okay, they're kind of in hermit energy here. You could be dealing with the Virgo. You could be dealing with the Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. It could be anyone. I've also got um, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. You could be a Virgo. Yeah, see, you're the one that this person wants. And they're seeing you out here. This looks to them like you're getting a lot of good luck, okay? That's what it looks to them like. Um, and they also see you making some big accomplishment or reaching some kind of huge glow. Um, I wanted to say glow. I mean, I meant to say goal, um, but I said glow. So you're like on some kind of glow up or you're absolutely glowing right now. This person is seeing this. Um, they're uh, somehow they're able to watch you, maybe on social media, something like that. But um, they're seeing you so happy, so incredibly happy, just doing your thing. You know, this is you winning, right? This is a this is winning or a lot of winning. This is like a glow up. This is you becoming abundant, successful, getting a lot of opportunities towards you, right? Um, everything just kind of happening for you, falling into place for you for a change, okay? And this is you moving forward very quickly. So, yeah, this is what they see. And they may think that there's just no way you could ever want them back or there's no way um, that they could ever be enough for you okay or maybe they don't think that you'll ever forgive them after how badly they hurt you either way this person is crying over you okay they miss you really bad and they want to take this action it's getting to the point where they can't sit in this life that they chose anymore they can't just sit here and waste any more time 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 is a thing some there's something about time in this reading this person feels very pressed for time right now but they also realize that they wasted too much time so you know and they want you but they're with someone else you know um, they sat and they wasted all this time and now they feel like they don't have enough. You know, they pushed you away only to end up missing you like crazy. This person is like, man, they're like a walking contradiction. You know what I mean? <laughs> I mean, come on. Oh, this is the one I want. Let's see what they want to say to you. I mean, this, this person's mind must be a mess, okay? Yeah, see, life without you is hopeless, dark, and depressing. I miss your light. Yeah, they miss you. They miss the energy you brought into their life. They miss the way you made them feel. They miss the closeness between you two. Or um, they just, they, they miss your essence, you know, your energy. This person doesn't want to be with whoever they chose. They want to be with you. Why is it that you love me? See, then they're, um, they feel like they're not enough for you now, okay? But you have this person triggered. Yeah, I, they, I wish I could be fully honest with you. This person wants to tell you how they feel about you. You've got them triggered with whatever it is that you're doing. I feel it mostly, mostly what you're doing is making a decision to leave them behind. That's what have, has them triggered. Your decision to leave them behind and having that energetic cut off, you know, and then moving on with your life and being this happy and winning this much, all of this has this person triggered, all of it. Okay, the way I've treated you is wrong. 
I don't even know where to start. Yeah, this person did so much wrong to you. They, they don't know um, how you'll ever forgive them. I mean, that's how much they did that was wrong. The way I've treated you was wrong. I don't even know where to start. Yeah, they can't take their life anymore. Is it really over? Is it really? Really? They don't, they don't, they can't accept that it's over. Okay. What else can you show me? Oh, what is this one? I didn't notice that sitting there. I want to be different. Feel like, yeah, they, um, they wish they could have chosen differently. They wish their life would have ended up differently. Um, they wish they could do it all over again. You know, if they, if they had a second chance, they would never hurt you again. Yeah, I need to figure myself out. They need to figure out what they're going to do here. You know, they want to come in so quickly. They want to communicate. I feel like you, you probably will get a text message or a voicemail from this person. But here's the thing. They're still with someone else that they don't want. They may feel obligated to stay there, especially if they got someone pregnant, if they started a family with someone, if they got in a commitment. You know, but the fact of the matter is this person had plenty of time to figure this out. And you just don't want to wait around for them anymore. You can't. You can't. Look, you've learned your lessons. You've passed your tests. You are ready to move forward, man. You've been in stagnancy. You've been in isolation. You know, you've done your healing. All right, you've, you've worked on yourself. You've done everything here that you had to do. If you were to stay in stagnancy, waiting, waiting for this person, okay, to maybe decide who they really wanted or get their life together, it would be excruciating for you to sit in stagnancy anymore. You're ready to fly. And Things are going to start happening for you so fast. I can see it in this reading. Okay? Um, all I need to see are three cards. Boom, boom, boom. Things are going to start happening for you very quickly. And you got to be ready for it, man. When you see an opportunity, you have to be able to reach out and take it. Not just physically, but mentally and emotionally as well. Like you're just moving forward. And I feel like you've shifted. You went through a shift. And that shift was all about the way you perceive this all. Okay? It's all about um, making that judgment call. Right? Saying enough is enough. And switching your focus into what's coming for you in the future. And that's that shift. That's what you've went through. You can't go back. You can't go back now. You've had too much growth. You know? It would be like you as an adult trying to squeeze into the clothes you had when you were seven. You know? Uh, the seams on those clothes are going to rip, tear. Y you've grown. And, and I feel like your life, y you're, you're letting your life grow right along with you now. Before, everything seemed block, blocked, slow, um, stagnant, not anymore. I feel like you're just kind of going with the flow now, and the, and the pace is picking up. It, seriously, the speed is picking up here. So start, you're going to start noticing, like, lucky changes happening for you really quick. And that's what you're focused on. Yeah, this person misses you. Okay, they miss you. You know, they made their decision. They got with someone else. Yep, they miss you. Yeah, they do. Oh, well. You, I mean, I'm sorry, but look at all that you have to do here. Look at all that you have to fill your new future with. And you cannot sit and wait for this person to figure out their life.
anymore. You have your own life to live, and that's what you're doing. That's why they feel so pressed for time. There's no time left. You're already starting to fill your new future. You know? So they're wondering, is it over? You know, what do they think? Yeah, I feel like it is over. I do. I feel like, um, especially if this person doesn't communicate, it looks like they want to, but they're with someone else. And as long as those two things are going on, them not communicating with you and them being with someone else, where do they expect this to go? Where do they expect this to go? You know, and these are their decisions to stay where they are. So you're moving forward. Okay? You're moving forward. And Spirit is giving you these blessings to make sure that you have everything you need so that you can move forward. Just go with it, collective. I, I'm telling you, I, I feel like, look at the pleasant look on your face in all the photos, okay? Or in all the pictures. There's this beautiful smile on your face. Look at that. Peaceful, calm, just plucking those blessings out of the sky. That's kind of what you're doing in this picture. Having this glow up, feeling very, very proud of yourself, feeling accomplished, knowing how far you've come. Look at you. You're, you're smiling here, too, as you move forward quickly. I feel like this person has already lost you. Okay. Yeah, I just heard, I'll be two steps behind. Yeah, baby. Um, who sings that song? Oh, maybe that's what it's called. Something about two steps behind. Yeah, they're way behind you, man. They're way behind you. I feel like this person is not at your level. They didn't put in the work. They didn't do anything to change your situation. They didn't communicate with you. They never apologized to you. They didn't bring you closure. They didn't give you any attention. Like none. But they were giving it to someone else. You know, I guess that's just, that's... It's the way it goes, okay? Yeah, that they don't want to accept that it's over, but shoot, man, what did they give you to hold on to? Yeah. Anyway, that's what I have for tonight's reading. This person is starting to frustrate me, you guys. They are. I mean, come on. This is a, this is a grown adult who is staying somewhere that they don't want, not being honest, not not um, admitting their feelings, not doing the right thing, feeling sorry for themselves. I mean, come on. You know what, Collective? You just keep focusing on all of these blessings that are coming in, okay? And drop a comment. Let me know. Is it starting to get easier for you? Are blessings rolling in? Because that's what's going to happen here if it hasn't already started, okay? Yeah, any.